Hi guys, welcome to Shahin Vlogs. Hope you are safe and in good health wherever you are. Ramadan Mubarak to all my viewers. Here I am sharing a few make and freeze recipes to concentrate more in prayers. Let's start with instant gravy, a common one to be used in multiple recipes. Take a vessel and heat 250 ml oil. Add 1 cinnamon, 10 cloves and 3 cardamom. Once they crack, add 4 big onions sliced. When onions are about to turn brown, add ginger garlic paste 3 tablespoon. Let the raw smell go, add garam masala 1 tablespoon. Now add chilies. Time to add 6 tomatoes chopped. Add salt to cook fast. Once the tomatoes have turned soft, add red chilli powder 3 tablespoons. Coriander powder 2 tablespoon. Mix well and cook for 5 more minutes. The oil comes out in the sides. Now turn off the flame and cool down to room temperature. Once cooled down, mix everything well, add it in a glass jar, cover and freeze it. Before cooking, take one container and keep it out for 15 minutes. Let's see how I made Hushka and Kheema with this instant gravy. Saving your time by showing dual clippings. Heat a cooker. Add our instant gravy. Heat it for a while. In Hushka, add coriander and mint leaves, add water and salt if required. In Kheema, fry the Kheema in the instant gravy for a while, check salt, add if required.
add water with this instant gravy you can make multiple recipes vegetables paneer mushroom as well trust me i have never made any recipe so quick this has reduced huge time in cooking if you don't trust me give it a try you will understand Let's make instant green chutney a much needed one in iftar. In a blending jar add half bunch cleaned mint leaves, half bunch coriander both equal, four green chilies and five garlic cloves. Add tamarind pulp 1 teaspoon. and salt as required forgot the clip sorry grind it into a smooth paste add the chutney in ice tray and freeze it use when required let's make a refreshing squash i have taken 500 grams of purple grapes add water 250 ml and cook until the grapes become soft once they are cooked let them cool down add it in a blender and extract juice out of it strain the juice and remove the skin now we need sugar syrup take 250 grams of sugar and 200 ml of water let the sugar melt we need a sticky thick syrup we don't require any string formation the syrup must be little thick and sticky like this off the flame and let it cool down now heat the grape juice strain the sugar syrup into the juice mix well and cook it for 15 minutes in low heat
our grape squash is ready. Now cool it down to room temperature. Store in a glass jar in your fridge. When required, take a glass, add some ice cubes, add the squash till one fourth level of your glass. Dilute with water and mix. Your grape juice is ready in an instant. This homemade squash is free from any preservatives unlike the store bought ones. Few more instant recipes coming up in the next video so stay tuned. Also watch my last year Ramadan video where I have made much more recipes. See you all in the next video. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.